You know, sometimes on this car you have these, these strange things happen that just they don't make any sense. And uh, sometimes it helps if you if you actually if you know what's going on. But the last couple of years I've just been involved really mostly involved in just the electronics on the car because that's where most of my problems came from. But one of the one of the things I learned, I just thought I would share, is the throttle position sensor right here and the map sensor share the inside of the electronic control module. There's a little uh, five volt regulator. So this this would be kind of like a typical uh, five volt regulator inside of an electronic control module in a car. You know, you would have like 12 volts in here. The middle would be a ground. And then you would have a, it regulates to 12 volts and you would have uh, 5 volts out. Uh, 12 volts in, a ground, and then 5 volts out. Well, the throttle position sensor and the map sensor share the same 5 volt regu uh, regulator inside the control module. So, like if you, if it, if it shorts out, short to ground, short to voltage, or it has any kind of an, an anomaly on it, you can test the you test the the uh, throttle position sensor, and it tests bad. So you replace the throttle position sensor, or the same thing on the voltage. I mean the uh, map sensor. You replace it, but then you still have the exact same problem. More than likely, that's short, uh, short to ground, short to short to voltage. Burned out that five volt regulator inside of the control module. And unfortunately, the best thing to do there is is uh, is just replace the electronic control module. Well, you if the uh, if the throttle position sensor or the map sensor shorts out internally, more than likely it's it's shorted out the the uh, five volt regulator inside of the control module too. So the best thing to do is just replace. You're gonna have to replace the your device which would be your throttle position sensor or your map sensor and the electronic control module unless you know somebody who re rebuilds them but anymore it's almost cheaper to get an aftermarket refurbished control module it's about the same price but sometimes I you know it helps to know what 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 goes on on these cars because uh, you know I've had other people say you know I I had problems I replaced the map sensor and I still had the same problem so it wasn't until I replaced the map sensor and the electronic control module that actually solved my issue. So sometimes it helps to know what's going on.